interrupt graduation and everything. Uh, I was looking for Mr. Brackett. Hey, Mr. Brackett. Uh, Mr. Brackett, weren't you up for this Teacher of the Year thing? No. Uh, John. Tom. Uh, in ineligible. Uh, Mr. Brackett is he's no, no longer no longer an employee here. Oh, why? What happened? He resigned. Sadly. It's fine, Cameron. It's all over and done with. It's, it, today belongs to the students. Yes, this is for, for the kids, for the youngsters. They can do? Wait, is this about the Oscars and the gay thing? No. No, 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 no. no, no. 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 Then what is it? Well, we, we felt the, the community... Uh, uh, felt uh, that that it was it was a question of, of uh, influence. I'm sorry, uh, I'm a little slow. <laughs> I was a C student and now I'm uh, I'm, I'm an actor. So <laughs> influence. Well, you know, it, I mean, it's all right to be uh, this way or that way at home. You know, in in your in your private area Ar arena arena. But uh, but uh, Mr. Brackett, after all, is was uh, a teacher. Oh, I see, I see. So you're thinking about the students? Yes. yes that's that's what that's what this is all about. Oh, okay. So all right. So um, stay with me here, then. So what you're saying then is, since Mr. Brackett's gay, that uh, he's gonna like send out some kind of voodoo vibes or. Uh, gay microwaves and, and uh, make everybody else gay. Well, in a in a in a in a crude crude manner of speaking. Well, seniors, you've all had Mr. Brackett. Is that the way it works? Yeah, kids, this you really you don't have to answer that time, time and place discussion. to discuss it. Completely answer that. inappropriate for oh, oh, really? This is so still a graduation ceremony. May I please finish my acceptance speech? Hoosiers. What is the definition of a Hoosier? Well, way back in seventeen hundred. Who said that? Jack. I had Mr. Brackett for senior English. He taught me Shakespeare. Well, he was my track coach and he also helped me get into college. I just realized that what Mr. Hallowell said is right. Must have rubbed off. I'm gay. You see, this is exactly my point. A young life corrupted. Thank you. Very brave. Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! Young, la young lady? It's happening! I had Mr. Brackett all year and... Oh my god! I'm gay! Excuse me? If there's something wrong with Mr. Brackett or Jack, then there's something wrong with me. I'm gay. So am I. Oh, you're she not. is not. You're not. I know you're not. You're a tramp. Mike. Michael. Oh, man. There we go. All right. I'm gay. I'm a homo. I like guys. I mean, I still do it with chicks every chance I get, and I'm totally good at it. But I hate it, and I'm gay. Kids, 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 please, please sit down. We're here to graduate. I'm sure Mr. Brackett is gratified by, by your display. Compassion is, is a wonderful quality, however misguided. But as Howard very well knows, the decision is not yours. It is a gonad thing. A, a, a grown-up thing. I have to answer to the community, and as far as the community is concerned, toward Howard Brackett, they have said no no, no. Please sit down and let's pass out some diplomas. Well, I'm a... I'm a member of the community and I don't mind that Howard's gay. But, but you're his brother. As, as, you, as, you, as you know. So you know what that means. Uh-oh. I must be gay. <laughs> uh, but, but, uh, but you're not a parent, are you? Excuse me, I'm a parent. 
I've lived in this town all my life. I'm Howard's father. And I'm gay. I'm Howard's mother, and I'm very proud of him. And I'm, I'm, I'm a lesbian. <laughs> Excuse me. Hi. I run the bridal barn for better brides, and I can tell you, Howard has perfect taste. So do I. So, I'm gay. I'm Howard's stylist, and I'm gay. And I'm bald. I deliver Howard's mail and everybody else's. I'm a federal employee, and I'm gay. Fire Chief Fred Mooney and the Volunteer Fire Brigade. Howard has always been ready to lend a hand. Maybe Mr. Brackett deserves something else. <laughs>